So I'm going to show you how to tell if your switch is bad. Um, and this is a horn switch. So um, there's two terminals. Um, one's your power in and the other goes to the device, uh, which in this case is a horn. And when you press the switch, it should connect these two terminals and let the power go to the horn. Um, so I have my multimeter set to continuity. Um, so it'll make a noise and give us the resistance reading uh, when it measures um, continuity between these two terminals. Okay, so when I press the switch, nothing happens. I still have uh, open circuit. That's what the one means. Okay, so I know that this switch is bad because I should hear this beep. Let me show you on a new switch. So this is brand new out the box. Um, hook the red up to one of the terminals, black up to the other, it doesn't matter which. And I'll just show you by touching them together, this is what should happen if the switch is working. So I'll hook it up to the other terminal. Okay, and when I press the switch, you see zero resistance. Um, with the switch pressed, uh, and these two things are getting connected. Another way you can tell if you don't have a multimeter is if you leave your horn hooked up, um, you can take a jumper wire like this and connect it, just touch it to the two terminals. And if your horn goes off, that means your button is bad. If pressing the button doesn't make the horn go, but jumper wire makes the horn work, uh, then you know you've got a bad switch.